Sup, and good day, gamers. A formal bust here with Elderborn, a first impression. But first, we have our sponsor, H2O, drink it up or die. Mm. Oh, it's the quenchiest. Now let's get into this. Elderborn was released in January of 2020, developed and published by Hyper Strange. Elderborn uh, is described on Steam as Elderborn, a metal. AF, they define as action fantasy, slasher with brutal FPP, melee combat, and Souls-like, that's a first-person perspective, I believe, and Souls-like RPG character progression. In the times of legend, barbarian tribes need a new dark messiah, but that merciless slayer uncover ancient secrets in the city of doom. Forge your own destiny. Tagged on Steam as Souls-like, first-person, dark and dark fantasy. Retails on Steam for 19.99 United States dollars. Um, the only DC uh, DLC that there is is a soundtrack and a digital art book. I will say it's nice on the main menu here. We have main menu uh, music going right now, but if I wanted to, I can just hit play on the uh, soundtrack of the game. So that's nice uh, if you for something chiller <laughs> for your main menu um, hearing. You can go through the whole whole playlist. All right here, built-in player. That's nice to see. Settings, controls. Uh, the, the whole menu is like this. The whole menu has, I can't scroll this, I can't notch over or whatever. It's, nope, it's, you can click somewhere or you can drag it to where you want to. So that's somewhat frustrating, but <laughs> That's I, So far, that's the only thing I've seen that I dislike about the main menu. Uh, that's controls. Gameplay. You got difficulty, normal hard, Elderborn hard AF, which uh, it would be hard action fantasy as this game uh, description tells us. Language. Uh, what all we got on language? We got English, Polisky, Dutch, Francis, Espanol, Italian. Uh, oh, wow. Ma Magar, Magar. Don't know what either of these are. Sorry. So, these are your languages. Good good roundup on there. Uh, auto aim. There's an auto aim. I don't know if it's aim assist or if it's an auto auto aim, but I'm not going to test it out. They got gore particles, decals, or particles and none. Um, crosshair enabled defense indicator. Don't know what that is, but I guess I will find out as I play the game. Hit value indicators, definitely want that. Field of view, got a nice spread. We go to 60 to 120. Nice. I, I want to keep mine around 100. Graphics. No motion blur. No, no, no motion blur. Uh, you got, you know, low, medium, high. I got mine on custom just because I got some things off, but for the most part, everything is as high as it can be. Uh, you got target frame rate, which is nice. Um, I'm going to mess with this later, but render mode is normal. Your dad's VCR, DMX drops, PC 1996, and artsy-fartsy. So we're going to go with normal, and if I can, I'm going to try to change it in the middle of gameplay and see what that, <laughs> what that looks like. I'm sure it... We'll cross that bridge when we get there. But yeah, that's interesting. Uh, interesting to have different render modes in the game. I, I like that option, possibly. And sound, pretty simple. You got global volume, special effects, music, ambient, and subtitles. Enable or disable. Rather light on most things, but tons of stuff in the graphics to mess with. I just wish their, uh, yeah, settings. I wish, yeah, this, this, this slider bar thing. I, I dislike, I dislike that. But since that's it, um, let's just get into Elderborn. Okay. Okay. Interesting. You get, uh, essentially, I guess, just choose your sex. They both seem to be uh, pretty buff. Uh, and, yeah. He's got a pauldron and a top notch. She's got a big old sword. I, I, I can't see his sword, so I'm going to go with her sword because it looks better. Iron Man mode, permadeath, if you want that. You can change it later in gameplay settings. It does not affect trophies. So, yep, we're going to go with normal. Elderborn. We've been told legends of the day that the sky has fallen. The world filled with death and despair as the land of our ancestors turned to ash. But the tribes... We survived. At the center of all destruction, a mighty city rose in the desert. 
Yurmum, feeding off the strange power flowing from the never-ending tempest above. It remained unconquered. Yurmum and its golden army were the bane of the realm for ages. The tribes toiled in its shadow, bound in its relentless grip, enslaved and oppressed. Until a warlord came, who united our tribes and led them against the city. His name was Yanis, a hero anointed by the elders, standing a giant among men. Yanis's warriors never returned, but the city fell silent, sealed shut, dormant for centuries, closely guarding its mysteries and treasures. Our elders are the three keepers of the past. They tell us the city holds a great prize. The very secret of eternal youth. They seek to possess that power in every generation. A champion of the tribe is chosen by the elders. With their blessing, they are set on a holy pilgrimage to explore the city. The champion is decided in trial of combat. I've mastered all my brothers and sisters. In this generation, the holy quest is mine. Leaving the familiar desert sands behind me, I enter the Forbidden Caves. This is the only remaining way to the sealed off city. No one returned from the pilgrimage, yet there is no fear in my heart as I stare into the darkness. Gripping my weapon, I step into the shadows and the shadows come alive. Okay, cool intro sequence. Oh, that's the loading screen, I guess. Nice to see whatever uh, character you pick, uh, male or female, they're represented in the intro, either. <laughs> Whichever one you're not picking, I get murdered <laughs> by the other. Nice fitting. Oh, wow, okay. Okay, I've got a block, right? Yep. Got a swing. Do I have a... Yep, heavy attack. Jump. Okay. No crouch. Maybe. Nope. No crouch. Alright. Yep. This is a trap. Okay. So we got traps. We gotta jump around. Not hit. Alright. Press E to interact. Okay. I gotta hold it. Some mechanism is working nearby. So we got tra Oh! Activate... Sorry, the mic bump coming in here. Activate a fountain to save progress. Drinking from an active fountain will heal you, but will also bring back sling. Okay, so very Souls-like. Fountain? Is this it? Oh, this is the fountain. So, I guess I don't have any healing. I just have straight up my health bar. Simplified Souls, it would seem. Left just to dash in any direction you perform attack while doing so, use this to your advantage. Oh gosh! Seems like a spike trap it would seem there. Guess I gotta dash over that. Can I I can I cannot jump and dash, but I can dash. Tap, left mouse, and yep, I figured that out already. Oh gosh! Feral Warrior, okay. Oh, nice. Feral Warrior, after the Battle of Yuruma, the fallen soldiers of the army, led by Janus, were se uh, sealed off within the city. They were not destined, however, to rest eternally. Sealed off in the catacombs, they still waged their war, led to battle not by their commander, but by muscle memory of their undying flesh. And they have, like, worms on them, it would seem. And I don't know what this other dot is, but whatever. Uh, tutorial, nice. Weapons. Old Blade. You can block! All income damage is reduced by 20%. Okay, slash type weapon, heavy sturdy. Alright. It's cool. Oh, another fountain already. Okay. Are you back? Didn't bring that guy back unless that's him. Hold right smile button to block. Some attacks are unblockable. They will break your defense but won't deal any damage. 
Okay. Barrel Hunter. Can I pick up your weapon? Don't think so. Okay, what's this? It requires a key. What can I? Nope, I won't. I don't have a key. Getting, getting like Doom vibes, but melee. Oh, I can kick. <laughs> I don't think I can come back from down there, but that's the only way I can go. Let's go. Tap F to kick through your enemy's defense. Watch out for counters. Okay. I wonder if I can get armor. Pick up. This might be useful. I guess it might be a key. Maybe. Okay. I got a ledge grab thing that automatically happens. It fits! And just opens. It doesn't change color. Okay. Got a little further range than it would seem. Maybe I should try blocking, possibly. I don't know what this blue shit is. Might be experience. I'm sure I'll find out at some point. Um, what do we got here? Pick up. Oh, okay. So I do get health vials. Okay. Or health injections, it would seem. This? No, it's not a door. I mean, it might be a door, but it's not openable. Oh! The well. Deepest... The deepest part of the cave beneath Urim. It's supposed to go down as far as the ancient mausoleum. No nobleman of Urim ever wandered there. It has always been one of the domains of the priests. I can't help but wonder what kind of rituals were so dark that they would not dare to perform them in the light of the surface atop their towers. Okay, so you got lore, too. Oh, are you... So I can activate. Okay, and then if I heal. So activating doesn't bring back enemies. It's. Yeah, let me see what that level is. Oh, another key. Let me get that, and let me heal myself and see what the little blue bar we're filling up does. Oh, okay, so it is level up. Press, uh, tap, tab, leveling up as possible when the icon is displayed. So I guess maybe in combat it's not. So, looks like I have might and speed and resilience. Resilience, additional hit points. Speed is I move faster in attacks and we're more swift. Might, your attacks deal more damage. Okay, and then I have charge. So this is probably an ability I get later on. Crush your foes with a mighty charge. Hold F to perform it. Your might is lacking. You need five more might. Rip and tear. Hold E over a fallen foe to rip its head off, then throw it. <laughs> okay. Get some ranged weaponry in there, and then stomp. Hold F midair. Okay, so strength stuff, or might stuff. Speed. Successfully pair your projectile to launch it at nearest foe. Your speed is lacking. Okay. Essence Hunter, spend less time chasing after Essence. It will fly towards you on its own. That's nice. I guess that's what I'm picking up. Air dash. In midair, you can now perform a dash just like on the ground. Okay. So, you need a lot of speed. This seems simple, but... Okay, these are... Just keys. Okay. What's this? Oh, that's my codex or whatever. Resilience when your health is low. Rest and recover 50% of your total HP. Okay. You get a chance to kill a foe and regenerate... Okay. You get a chance to kill a foe and regenerate when your HP... Yeah, so resilience is what I want eventually. But I'm real interested in the essence hunter, so we'll go at least somewhat into speed. One okay, yeah, one point per level. Okay. Seems fair. Another key fits. That's I wanna get in there, but I can't oh what was Oh yeah boy, that's that's an effective trap.
Was this a trap? I don't know. Oh, and yeah, recover. Okay. So you gotta recover your stuff. That looks important, but I don't think I can get in there. Nope, I can. Okay. Oh gosh, where'd you come from? Oh, you're in the other cage. Okay. And that also opened this up. Awesome. Yeah, it's not so much Souls-like, because... I mean, I have a dodge, but I mean, so far I don't have enough room to use it, really. It just seems more of, you know, circle-strafing your enemies. Master of the Old Blade. Successfully block attacks with an old blade. Okay, so I get challenges too. Stats, that's nice. And yeah. And I get a reward of essence. Okay, so if I block stuff enough arrows, it would seem. Oh, this is. Oh! Okay, yeah, I didn't even notice this. What is. Oh, I can level up. I wanted to get five speed, right? Yeah. Oh, wait. No, just one level. Okay. Yeah, I can see. I don't know how. If there's a limit cap on your movement speed and leveling up, but. Yeah, no, this seems crazy. Extra. Okay, so just extra essence. I mean, I'll take it. I ain't complaining. friends over here? I'm not complaining. Thank you. Oh my gosh, what was that? Arrows? Arrows. Can I get... Yeah, I can get up this. Okay. Nope. Don't kick that. Pick it up. Yeah, I wonder what the weapon choices are going to be. Wait, can I? Oh, okay. Yeah, so you can break pots. Okay, great. Great, great, great. It's just a farm through here. I mean, I guess if you aggroed them all at once, you might be in trouble, but... It is pretty quick. So there's another level. I don't know if I can get to it though. No, I don't think that's a sheer cliff. I think I get to it later. We'll assume I get to it later. Yeah, this this totally takes me up there. Okay. Oh, helps turn around. I'm loving this. It, it's a sim it's like a simplistic style of choice, but like it tells a story, you know. Going from kind of ruined uh, stuff to like carved out catacombs almost. Nice. Oh gosh. Yeah, do not care for you. I do not want to fall, no. Oh, what is it? R? Yeah, R. Okay, let's level up. Oh, I thought I had a level up. I have to wait for it to tell me, so I'm probably in combat right now is the issue. Or I might need to be near one of those wells to level up. Is this where I came from? This is totally where I came from. Okay, got turned around. I think it turned around. It went all the way around it. Hey, yes. Activate. I 
can level up. Do I have... Doesn't tell me how many I have. Okay. Alright. So, I need one more to get the essence being drawn to me. Okay, so that goes somewhere and that goes somewhere. Okay. Oh, here's an archer guy. I want to kill him. No reason not to. Alright, now one word and upward. need to block, it seems, in this game. At least yet. Nice. More essence. That'll be on a level. Is this just a pool? Yeah, this isn't a waypoint. Whatever. Well, that's what they're called. Uh, I can get up here, right? I can totally get up here. Don't know what that does, but it will do something. If I can just knock you off the cliff, why do I even need to fight you? Ugh. Yeah, those pustules are like breaking off of them too when I kill them. Or hit the pustules, so they're like breaking. Huh. What's the lore? What is the lore significance? Oh my gosh, just like Dark Souls. You can see much further than just your immediate surroundings and just a scale of where you're at. Okay, you're gonna... Okay, I can't hit it, but... Who knows how in-depth the physics are? That will never not get old, I'm sorry. Oh, a new well. Okay. Means I can get a level up too, right? Activate that. Let me level up. I can get to four. It's five. Do I have to spend... I want Essence Hunter. I don't know if that cost me a point or not. Oh, no, it definitely cost me a point. Okay. So getting a perk forgoes the point. Oh. Character sheet and codex. Okay. That's the character sheet. That's the codex. Okay. Was that it? Collect 1,000 of enemy drop in 10 seconds. Okay. I need to do more blocks. I don't think... No, I'm going to have to go around and... Oh my gosh. Okay. That's, that's worth one. What is down there? Is that all... I think that might be all the way back to the bottom I was at earlier, but I'm not sure. Oh my gosh, I don't think you're supposed to be able to scale that. I'm going for it. I'm going for the essence. Let me go to the next. Let me get to the next well and then back. Oh, I think I have to go down. Oh, okay, so I can break stuff. I just need a heavier tool, whatever that means. Probably a different weapon. So I gotta go down, maybe? Okay. This music's good. Yeah, I gotta go down. There's a little step right here. Okay. 
Doink, doink, doink. Doink, doink. Oop, I'm going for it. Team Essence. Okay, this is your first weapon spear thing. But where do we... What do we got? Okay, we're gonna have to check that out later. This is just a pile of coinage. Oh, no, this is another tablet. Refuge. I call this place a refuge with dark sarcasm. It seems less dangerous than the fire pit below, and there aren't as many undead here. But it is to be. But is it is it to be considered safe? I'll try to push on, find my way to the bottom mausoleum. Maybe the rumors of a way out are true. One thing I know: I prefer the uncertainty of the underground than the slow decay and despair of the town. That is still great in my memories. Great. Depressing as fuck, but great. Okay. Oh, it is my... I think my vial thing uh, recharges over time, but I don't know. Can I pick up? Oh. This might be useful. Press Q to swap weapons. Just the right tool for the job. Ancient spear. This is a thrown weapon, I guess. I can... Oh. Okay, so I can parry. Okay, you know, I can... I just, I don't have a block with this. Drowner. Bloated creatures swollen from liquid to the point that they barely resemble humans. They're more agile than they look. Yeah, for sure. I thought I'd have more reach, but I think I have about the same reach with this. Oh, gosh. It does seem to be attacked a little quicker, though, which is nice. Oh my gosh. This is the fire pit they were talking about. Okay, and you can actually aim... You can aim to not hit their, um... To not hit their shield. All right. Well, I, that's where the well is. I can't go back though. Oh, go oh my gosh! Flame or magma scorpions? Lava scorpion. Okay. We'll check that out in a second. Let's get resilience. I think I'll need that. Lava scorpion. Scorpions seem to be indigenous to the catacombs fire pit. Not only giant in size, but also burning from the inside out. Breaking open there, carapace releases the lava. Okay, so that could be trouble in a tight space. Okay. Jesus Christ, this game's getting more and more metal. Master of Magnet, okay. Challenge complete, right? Yes. So, claim reward of a shit ton of essence. Oh no, I want to claim that when I'm near a well so I can level up. That takes me back up, but... There was other paths. I do prefer the sword. A little slower, but it seems to do more damage, I think. This is where I was. Oh wait! Just just chilling here? No, it just lets me level up. Okay. That's yeah, the resilience for now. We'll do might later. Oh my gosh. Okay, no, the spear definitely has more range on it. Yes, which is preferable for these these uh, lava scorpions. This goes up here. Oh gosh, oh gosh, oh y'all y'all are all up in here, aren't you? And they unblockable attack it would seem. Okay. That was not so much fun. Ooh, another tablet. 
fire pit, despite being underground, it's brighter and hotter than the desert. The flowing lava makes the walls look as if they were alive. Such a place could not even support actual life. However, if it wasn't for the magic sustenance that Jarum provides, it's amazing. Our essence runs deep. Okay. I think this is it. I think this is a little side room that... This is the side path I should have gone on, unless... No, I can't. That doesn't have to get anywhere. But there is... If I could... Yeah, I think that's a later thing. I can't get up there right now. Alright, onward and hopefully upward to there. So what does chilling in here do? Well, firstly... Uh, challenges, right? Yep. Master of Magnet. Claim that, and that'll give me a level up, I think. Yes, yes, yes. Give me that resilience. I can see the souls likeness of this, but I would say it's a completely different animal. Being first-person perspective and more of a more of a classic um, uh, circle strafing kind of damage avoidance. I mean, I do. Oh shit! Fucking lava. I do have um, dashing, but at least where I've been so far, it seems like I can't really make use of that. Okay, I'm gonna go over here. Oh, always pick up keys. Those are important. And this is hey, this is where I was. Okay. I knew I could get up here if I believed in myself. Tomb Raider. Nice. You dead? Okay, you dead. And then up. I want to get up there too, but that might be risking it. Oh no. Okay. Ooh. Okay. So, not so much of a platformer, more of a shove your face into the fucking into the wall and hope you can climb it. Oh, friendly fire, nice. Okay, so I do get like a pause game there. Come on. And combat is a bit slow at times, it seems. Not like ridiculously slow, but slow. Slower than, you know, uh, some games. Oh, nice. Activate. Oh, I do have a level. There's just a few more. Two more levels, really. Oh, god damn it. I hate those guys. Hey, you know how I said I wanted to get up here? Lo and behold, I totally missed that. Not even that one. Get me, get me in. Okay, let's go back. Be aware of your surroundings, gamers. This is what happens. And nope, that's not. I need to go this way. And I have that fountain back there, but let's keep on moving forward. I'm not getting my ass handed to me yet. Okay. Mummy! Oh, the mummy's dead. Okay, so first kind of boss, I would say. Oh, enemies. Mummy. Oh! Oh, okay. So after you kill enough, you get all the info on them. So I know that feral warriors have 120 hit points. Yeah, vulnerability to slash, blunt, and pierce. Which I guess I just have slash and pierce right now. But... Where's the... Oh, there's the mummy. These reanimated corpses, even though they were trapped tightly and their life organs were removed and replaced by dry straw, okay, managed to retain the most mobility among the denizens of catacombs. They move with purpose so their mind's not entirely gone. Okay, so... Oh! There we go. That looks like a bludgeon. Master of the hammer. Easy peasy. Coffer hammer can block. Okay, the attacks can't be interrupted. Alright. Ancient Spear, Old Blade, Coffer Hammer. Let's go break down some walls. Break down some barriers, game. Oh, okay.
So there is friendly fire in this game completely. So if you manage to get your enemies lined up right, you can have them almost kill themselves. Or each other, I guess. Last escape. Mic bump. Sorry. I'm torn between horror and awe. The embers here make this place seem so alive. Much more hopeful than the sights of decay above. If only I could forget who I am and spend the rest of my eternal life as a mindless creature roaming these corridors, that would bring me so much peace. Maybe if I could find some of these strange glowing maggots? Mmm, that's delicious. Strange glowing magnets. Oh, that's... So I want to get in that doorway as well. Okay. I definitely move slower with this equip, though. So I can't kind of dodge dash as much. It's more like, oh my god. Yeah, just, yeah, use the whole fucking hammerhead to block. Okay. Goodbye, wall. Oh! Full on Indiana Jones in here, I see. Okay. Let's see where they're coming from and move to a lighter weapon to move about, I would say. Okay. I feel like that's going to be a one-hit KO with that boulder, but we'll see. Oh, yes, here we go. More lore. Let's see, we've got descending here. This was a mistake. I should have stayed in Upper Yorum and died there. I fear all that waits for me here is a sudden and painful end. I only have a few tablets left, and I promised myself to make better use of them than to complain about my own fate, but that is before I set foot in this fire pit. Okay. Interesting. Gained essence. Interesting. Can I... Where are the boulders coming from? Am I about to... find out? Oh, that's where they're coming from. Okay. I should be able to move up through here now, which... Okay, a lever and a key. I don't have a key, right? I don't have a key. If I pull the lever... Oh, okay, that stops the boulders. Thank you. See, there was a reason to come up here. Very good reason. Although, with all the enemies I'm seeing as I'm headed down, it might have been a good idea to maybe, I don't know, plan for the boulders to kill my enemies, but, you know. I got a big hammer. How how hard could it be? This is where I came in. Yeah, this is where I came in. Okay. Stone scorpions. Some little scorpions look as if they were made of stone, and it's not only the looks. Hitting them will reveal that they are indeed a living rock, and thus extremely hard to kill. Now with my big hammer, though. My big hammer will kill them. Smash them. Yeah, two hits. Okay. I said easy, but now there's like two coming at me. Okay, we need to heal. Alright. This isn't too bad. Oh, that's where the boulders end up, I guess. Yes, this Tomb Raider. Oh, there's a Tomb Raider achievement. I think you need like 50 of those essence things to find. Okay. Oh, I know who you are. Yeah, you're not gonna fool me. Okay, so I can stop the mid uh, jump. That's good. Good to know. Hammer drawn, I can sidestep those fuckers. Did kind of get lost here. Oh! Okay, yeah, no, I know where I'm at. Okay. Alright, so the fire. Yeah, this is why I didn't check out. Okay. I really need to go there, get the key, and then move over to the right. Okay. Wonder where that goes. And I have that doorway I have to open, like, at the very beginning, almost, which. I don't even. Yeah, no, I jumped down, so I can't get back to it. All right. Meanwhile, let's go back up. All the way up. Not there. Fucking metal soundtrack on this thing. It 
looks like your dodge has like no cooldown either, which I love. Okay. Hey, another well. Perfect for my level up. And oh, you just I think you can just choose. Yeah, it's once you get to level five you can choose. Yeah, because I can't. Yeah. Okay, we're held as low. Rest and recover fifty percent. You get a chance to kill a foe and regenerate when your HP drops. We're gonna go with that. It's weirdly, it's weirdly, you get a chance to kill a foe and regenerate when your health HP, when your HP drops to zero. I don't know if that means I get a chance to, whenever I kill a foe, there's a chance I regain HP, or when I my HP drops to zero, the enemy dies, and I, yeah, I don't know. Oh, the mummies are back. Oh, nice. A little slow-mo action. The Gravekeeper. Achievements on this game are pretty dope. Another key that goes somewhere. Another tablet. Eternal Stillness. It's a true wonder that I find such a complex maze of corridors and rooms under the city. They were always there under my feet as I lived my life above before the barbarian... Bar before the barbarian invasion and before the great schism so many things have changed up there i imagine that these parts remain the same as they have been for centuries okay oh there's lights and i can break the lights it would seem can i they just come back on. That's great. You just hit them and they turn off for a second. Okay. That looks breakable to my hammer. Oh gosh. Or to a mummy jumping out. Okay. Yeah, you actually have to break them. You can't just knock them over. All right. Just empty, okay. Is this the key I needed? Oh, blue door instead of a red door. No, that key was for somewhere else. Okay. Let me go back there and chill and level up. I'd like to get five in. Well, I don't know. We'll see what Might has. I don't know if I want to level Might up at all. I think I might just want to stick with resilience. What do I get? Crusher Foes and Mighty Charge. Okay. Yeah, I'm not really interested. Let me focus on resilience. Yeah. Yeah, if I focus on resilience, I don't have to worry about how much damage I do. I can just tank it. That looks worrisome. Now that I see it. That could be nasty. Okay, so... Yes, glowing rock. Was this... Oh, yeah, I already looted that. Okay. Good fight, that is. Say that, and then all the fucking doors open up. Okay. So if I lose health, there's a chance to gain it back. Very Bloodborne like. Or if I hit quick enough. Oh my gosh. As long as I'm putting out damage. Oh, here's the key to that one. Okay. Oh, golly. 
Oh, that's the trap. Nope. Okay, so there's a chance. Oh, I didn't mean to waste that second one, but... Whatever. And can I... Nope. Doesn't do anything. Alright. Where do you go? Oh, is this... Yeah, this is where it was blocked out of earlier. Okay. Dope. Yeah, this is... Oh, I didn't mean to fall that far. Okay. Oh, well. Yeah, this is totally where it was at. Yeah, because down is to the fireplace. And All right. Good, good old Skyrim door just looping back to, you know, the beginning of the level. That's cool. So, I want to go in here and rest. <laughs> and I can't level up now. That's where I want to go, though. All right, yeah. Let me rest, kill some more guys, and maybe that'll be a level up. Who knows? I, really, though, I hate the shield enemies. Like, I get why I don't have a shield, I guess. It totally seems like I should be able to smash them open, but... I guess not. through the front tie with this sledge of a hammer. You have no defenses, yes. Was it Feral Shield Breaker? Okay, more HP, but similar uh, resistances or lack thereof. Is this guy's way? There you go. So walls remain broken. When I respawn, but enemies respawn. Gosh. Never gets old swinging this hammer around. Alright, blue door, blue key. Blue square key. It fits! Okay, light change. Still haven't made it to the fucking surface. I guess we're in the canyons now. Light music. Oh, and yeah, okay. Really, game? Two doors, two keys, right in a row? Whatever. Alright, I'm loving this. Let's get to the. Uh... Oh! I said let's get to the next well. We're here. We're totally here. And yeah, I don't want to fuck with scorpions yet. Let's uh, level up uh, resilience. Oh, yeah, gamers. I'm enjoying <laughs> Elderborn. This is fucking great. I'm loving this. Um, I will hopefully do a full review, but yeah, they say Dark Souls, like, you got, like, the bonfire, as it were, and the fucking, um, you know, healing vials and stuff, but, nah, this is, like I said, this feels more like Doom, in the, you know, tone of the music, and, uh, more melee focus, for sure, but yeah, nah, this is very nice, very nice game, well worth the, uh, 14.99 USD, uh, list price. But yeah, no, uh, check out Elderborn. I'm loving it, and we'll definitely play more of it. I'm gonna leave it right here, gamers. Uh, thank you for watching. Feel free to do the stuff. I've been a full bust. Until next time, take care and drink some H2O.